There was a shitty movie some years ago called Idiocracy that used a bunch of bio-truth, ableist bullshit to demonize the working class. Reflecting on it, though, if you cut out the prologue and leave the origin of the titular idiocracy at mystery, I feel that the movie can be a good metaphor for liberal capitalism. One of the plot points of the movie is that society is facing a dust bowl and a famine because they've gotten stuck on the idea of watering their crops with Gatorade as an ad campaign has convinced the public that electrolytes are what plants crave, which is often said by characters in the movie. Take away the explanation that haha people are genetically stupid and you have a situation with numerous parallels to what we are doing now. Look at the Pentagon. Look at the military industrial complex. Look at the projects that Congress, against the advice of generals, have pushed for, for the sake of creating jobs, bolstering their image as pro-military, or getting a factory in their congressional district. There is a massively expensive project for an air superiority fighter that with numerous design flaws that get sent into the production. The design flaws include not being able to fly in the rain, having poor visibility for the pilot, killing pilots, or all of the electronics bricking mid-flight when it crosses the international dateline. We've dumped trillions of dollars into it. In the movie, the main character, Joe, convinces the president to water the crops with water, like from the toilet. The decision was self-evidently correct, but upon doing so, the economy begins to fall apart because the company that made the Erstat's Gatorade was too big to fail. For the fighter jet, the sunk cost fallacy and inertia keeps the project going vastly over budget. The same metaphor applies to many other issues. Homelessness in the face of too many unsold houses, climate change denial in the face of overwhelming evidence, water being poisoned by fracking, and wars in the Middle East for oil because we won't reduce consumption. We now are and have been watering our crops with Gatorade. And it's not the fault of idiots or working class people having too many babies. It's that our whole society seemingly exists to justify capitalism, to make the rich richer. We are unwilling and unable under the dominant paradigm of private property and liberalism to make common sense structural changes without severely breaking something else. In the liberal market-based paradigm, we can't go green without forcing coal workers out of a job or automate work away without putting many people out on the street. What we've got to do is stop watering our plants with Gatorade. Capitalism isn't what plants crave, it's salt water. <laughs> Capitalism needs sweatshops and fracking and prison and poverty. Humanity does not.